Hey YouTube, so this will be another quick video and this is a video that I want to make to those that are watching and whoever stumbles across this and it's really going to be about why you need to get in the gym or why you need to be working on your fitness or why you need to just be working on your health in 2021. I have been um, down the rabbit hole um, as far as uh, fitness is concerned and far with other things, um, you know, watching content and did you know that over 70% of people in the United States are overweight? I'm gonna let that sink in. 70%. That is wild. And like, and when you start reaching the age gaps, like when people are in their 30s or 40s, 50s, and and, and I'm looking around now. So like I, I went to um Best Buy. Um, by the way, get Apple Care if you do have a newer version of iPhone. It if you if your phone has something happen to it, the biggest thing that always happens is a screen. It's recommended. I, my, I, my, I have an iPhone 11 Pro Max. Um, screen popped off on it. Well, it didn't pop off, but it broke. It was, you know, it was inputting things that weren't trying to. It, it, it was a disaster. And it was only $30 to get it fixed. If I didn't have Apple Care, that would have been over $300. Yeah, get Apple Care. But this is why you need to get in the gym for uh, 2021. It, there is no excuse. There is no excuse in 2021 to be overweight because because i'm thinking about it and and keep in mind i'm a young head i'm young you know but there is no excuse there is so many things you can do and 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 it's not about just getting in the gym because when you actually start i mean obviously whoever is older has been my age you know it's relatively easier to stay in shape but well what i'm noticing though as i you know keep you know trying to improve my routine and how i go about all of this is that 80% of it is what you do outside. That's if you're drinking enough water. That's if you're eating the you know the right things. And and I was I was getting my hair cut today. Um and you know I I overhear people talking about like being healthy and you know and you know trying to get their fitness on. And you, and not and usually they look like a grenade or <laughs> or a bowling ball or a bowling pin. That's my that's my favorite one. I made that one up myself. But it um and, and they were talking about like eating healthy and stuff like that. And honestly, it's it's really just calories in, calories out. Like if you check anybody else, when they say that, they are absolutely right. It, like you can you can eat McDonald's if you want. I wouldn't recommend it every day, but if like once or twice a week, if you, if that's something you crave. Um, I know one person was talking about how they um you know they you know they want to eat Chick Fil A because they like Chick Fil A. You can eat Chick Fil A. It's just the thing is is that you can't be eating Chick Fil A all the time because it really comes down to your macros. Um, are you getting enough protein? Are you getting enough carbs? If you work out, if you if you don't work out, um, honestly, I would tell you to stay away from carbs. Um. Whatever you don't burn of those carbohydrates, it translates to fat. And that's why I did keto for a bit and that worked out. Well, it didn't work out because I, I couldn't avoid sugar. <laughs> I, I was like, oh man. So I just switched to low carb. And when the pandemic hit or the, the beer bug, I was at like 180. And I was, man, I, I the photo of me got deleted because my phone was acting up. So I had to restore my iPhone. So I don't have that photo anymore. But I was at about 180 and some change did the low carb slash keto then switched to low carb got down to like 165 and now during my bulk i'm at about mm, like i said earlier it's about like 175 or so you know that's probably some water weight so probably like a good a good nice um high 172 but it, it, it's um it, it definitely was was a good change um and, and i don't know i enjoy it one of the motivations for me um staying in shape is because i mean i, I, I want to be in shape i want to look good when i take my clothes off Let's be honest. Like, like who who wants to look bad when they do, man or woman? Who wants to look bad when they take their clothes off? So it um yeah, get in the gym um and I think uh I think one of the things that I tried to never ever think about is that oh I'm young, I'm gonna be like this forever, and um and I as for as for the dudes um I'm not gonna, I've seen some people my age they you know they already uh let their hands off the gas you know they already let their feet off the gas pedal with that one and um and as for the women um you, you, I ain't gonna lie you kind of have it worse it's kind of in some case in some cases I think it's a little harder to uh lose weight so it's um so you definitely have an uphill uphill hill <laughs> to climb there but yeah um calories in calories out if you are working out make sure you get enough protein even if you're not working out get protein because it helps your body digest whatever it is you're eating it um it assists you in that but um yeah i i've, I've been on my craze and i've been um you know it, it, you feel good like i deadlifted today i squatted i benched i was working on my bench um 
Work, got the got a little bit of a pump here to like a few chest accessories after that and then um but yeah it, it um get get in the gym work on your health in 2021 if that's the one thing you can do like i was saying in the last videos in 2020 um go out for that jog even if it's 10 minutes like you know, like you don't understand like like you, you don't understand and definitely take pictures because when you start seeing that progress it um you start to feel a lot better about yourself. I mean, you probably do feel good about yourself, which is a good thing. But um, yeah, in 2021, let's keep our health right. Let's keep it right. And and now I'm not one of these like people that are like, yeah, let's keep our health right. And then you know they they got the love handles and all that stuff. And uh, no, let's actually make an effort and let's actually stay on top of this. And if you if you do um care um, I'll add some links in the description for uh some people that I watch um that um that that you know helped me um navigate like how i need to attack my fitness um i'm still i'm like i'm like not I, based on the weights <laughs> that i that i'm lifting um where i'm i've made a lot of progress but based on the lifts i'm kind of in the middle of uh i'm in the middle of novice and intermediate kind of my my squats um my squats probably like my highest uh ranking so that's where i'm like more intermediate at it's like when i get to about 300 or so that's when i'll be you know like intermediate and so on you know that's where i want to go and um like i said last year um my goal is to double all of my weight on on whatever it is and i i think i can do it maybe not my bench I think my bench is gonna take maybe it might take a year and a half it might i don't know i'm trying i'm doing higher reps to um to you know build that like that endurance so when i when i do have like a heavy set of um bench you know i just knock it out and um so yeah um i can even uh, leave a link to the program i use and, um um and when you when you when you start taking this seriously, like you're not going to be able to just follow one program. I mean, you could, you can have something be your foundation, but, um, yeah, you're going to have to switch it up. Cause that's where I'm at. Um, I've been doing strong lifts five by five, but, um, yeah, it's, um, I'm reaching those moments where, you know, now it's time to add other things. Like, cause like my arms, you know, I need, I need more, um, I don't know. I want more, I want more girth <laughs> in there. So I'm working on that, but yeah, that's really all I got. Um, 2021 work on your fitness. Come on. Let's not, Let's not be couch potatoes. There's so many at home things you can do. Like it, it's, it, it's really not that hard because I like me. I'm unapologetic when I speak to people. Like I don't, I don't. I, don't, I need to be better about this because I'm an empathetic person. But I, but I, I don't have a filter when it comes to a topic necessarily because I'm like, I mean, like like health <laughs> so you know i noticed some people they kind of get a little like um reluctant to speaking about it because they're probably not as um you know they're probably not doing any <laughs> doing it. like 80 percent of people don't go to the gym <laughs> so maybe 90 i think it might be 90 so yeah it um start working on your fitness man it, it's um it's not hard because you know that time that you use scrolling through your phone when you wake up or that you're watching netflix or that you're watching youtube videos heck you could watch a youtube video and work out at the same time never thought about that did you yeah so get on it um like comment share subscribe uh and then uh yeah we're gonna be pushing out more videos um catch you in the next one have a good one points i got aching joints ever since i was a kid i had to make a point i had to rip a crowd i had to make my vows to this thing that made me who i am and held me down shout out kyla holmes you made this house a home remember wishing there was way more to us than poems but that was back then i'm 22 now i got other avenues to get me through now